Hi guys, this is Reza over at Resilient Company and MintForge.com. Just wanted to show you guys the newest Bitcoin miners. This is the one terahash unit that just came today from DHL, my supplier. Um, just a quick unboxing here. It comes with, uh, first forewarning, it comes with the Chinese spec plug. So you'll need to get the pigtail cables from, you know, Fry's or Best Buy or somewhere. Probably about five bucks. So you need to pick that up. Um, comes with Ethernet cables, not sure why. Um, let me get it out of the box here. So there are a couple of different models. Um, this is the all silver one that you can see in my eBay ad. Um, we'll go around it here. It's pretty big. It's about the size of a desktop, full size desktop computer. Not much to see on the outside. The metal is pretty thick. Um, it is pretty sturdy. When I picked it up, you know, didn't hear any rattling or anything moving around, so it looks like it's pretty solidly built. Okay, so we got the miners inside in the office now. Let's just compare them side by side. These are the two different one terahash miners that I've been selling. Um, you can see the silver one is definitely taller and about maybe four inches. Uh, longer down the back and maybe two three inches taller I'll have these two running um, for a few days and see you know how stable they are hopefully they're both equally stable and um, everybody will be happy with the, the performance um, so let let me plug them in and see what kind of um, hashing results we get okay so we've got this one tera hash miner plugged in it is turned on but not currently hashing um, haven't plugged it into Ethernet yet, but what you can see here is it's on and it's not too loud. It's actually reasonable in um, in the decibels right now. Um, so all I did was I plugged it into a power outlet and turned on the switch right there on the power supply. So far, pretty easy. You can see the green lights on from the ASIC boards. It means it tells you they're working. Um, but not yet hashing, so let's let's plug it into Ethernet and see what happens here. Real-time monitoring link. Right away, you'll start to see some activity. That's the CG miner activity that you're seeing here. Um, so these are the four different modules that are installed on the board on the um, in the machine, and the the approximate hashing speed of each one. They seem to average out about um, just under a terahash.